Hello everyone, I'm the Dino Gamer. Welcome back to another slow motion car crash video. In today's video, we'll be driving this car along that drag ship in front of us. Then we'll be crashing into a massive mountain and well, observing the car crash in slow motion. First, we'll watch it in real time, next in slow motion, and afterwards, we'll check out the car crash from the driver's perspective, both in slow motion and real time. So anyway, I hope you enjoy. Okay, let's watch the car crash in real time speed. <laughs> Accelerating all the way up to 250 kilometers an hour, which is actually the max speed of this car in particular. That's two hits, and now we're flipping like crazy. Well, that driver is very dizzy, and just like that, the car crashes over. So, first stop, let's watch the car crash in slow motion. Well, I'm actually recording this first because the way the game works, but you'll see this afterwards. So we should get to around 250 kilometers an hour. Okay, and as we approach the mountain, I'll hit pause. Great. Now let's go to 16 times slower than real time, and well, I hope you enjoy. And that's the front of the car, you can see how it's shattered, trunk is open and gasoline everywhere. On the bottom left you can see a bit more descriptive view of the damage of the car. Something you wouldn't necessarily notice in real time speed. And around here is where we may start to do some flips in the air. Just about to avoid the tip of the mountain. Keep in mind, this is at 16 times speed. You can actually visibly see a bend in the car where we first impact the dirt, the mountain. So let's speed up time slightly more as we're doing so many turns. And back to 16 times and that was a massive impact that's where we lost the bonnet and now the car's on fire bounced incredibly high up the ground too if only there were ground physics added that would be very interesting to see if we bounced or just dug right into the ground let's see if you were a driver, would you still be alive? Yep, looks so. Okay, let's speed up them a bit more. And back to 16 times regular speed. And here we hit the back of the car, smashing it in. Driver's seat is still okay, bit bent in, but maybe you'd have barely survived and here we crash into the barrier at the back not with as much force because well you don't see much extra damage now let's speed up again this is real time and here we come to a stop let's see the tire still sort of work and the engine kind of works. Anyway, hope you enjoyed that. Now it's time for the driver's perspective. Now let's watch the car crash from the driver's perspective in real time speed. Which is over in like 10 seconds. First impact, second, and here we're doing flips. That's one dizzy driver. The glass is still intact. 
so would you have survived? Maybe. Okay, now from the driver's perspective, but in slow motion. And 16 times regular speed. Let's go to 8 times. Here we make second impact. This is where we start flipping around. Yep, even 8 times speed, still very dizzy. Third impact, this is where the car catches fire. Not sure how you would survive this. The front windscreen is still intact. And here is where we crash into the road and our car comes to a stop. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please consider leaving a like and subscribing. And until next time, I'll see you later. Bye for now.